What's up, y'all? We're Austin TV here at uh, Carl Strauss Brewery. Unfortunate result from earlier today. 3-0 defeat in the Western Conference Final, the biggest stage. Seems like the moment was too big for Austin FC. The plan blew up in our faces. What were your thoughts on that game, bro? Hey, man, you took the words right out of my mouth, bro. The moment was just too big for a second-year club, you know, that might have might have reached the height a little bit too soon than they were ready for. Um, you know, I, I really want to say that I'm, I'm, I'm proud of the work that our team and our fans put in this whole season, but I just I don't think that was the way we were expecting us to go out, man. We wanted to go out fighting and swinging, and we took one shot. What can you tell Austin FC fans, man, you know, that are hanging their head low? You know, what, what does this team have in store for them in the next two, three years, bro? What do you think? Hey, I know it's really hard to hear this, but we just got to keep believing. We got to keep putting the work in to make each match at Q2 a little bit louder than before. See the next two or three people next to us vibing in the same way as before. Um, and it's going to get better. You know, um, I, I, I have full faith in the Wolf Project. I think he's he knows the pieces that he's going to have in place for the next season. Um, and, and we move forward, man. So I think I think we hold our heads high and and we build. Anything else you want to say, my G. Paul? You know, this is my club. This is my city. These are my people. Y'all my people. And, and you know, aguantamos, Austin. A huevo. Aguante. Aguante, baby. Shout out, my G. Paul, here at a brewery in L.A. We're Austin TV. You already know. Let's already get it. already know, baby. Let's get it. What's up, y'all? We're Austin TV here in downtown LA. Shout out to the sponsor, Guadalupe Cordova, here with my G, Kevin Moreno. What's up, mate? 3 0 defeat to LAFC. Not the result we wanted. What are your thoughts on that match? Um, fuck, man. It was it was hard. It was hard to be there. Um, I mean, you know, we all came out here hoping for a win. Uh, unfortunately, we couldn't get it. Um, feels it seems like Stuber was the only one who like came out and really showed, you know, the puso huevos. Everybody else was just kind of like, eh, you know, whatever. I, I don't know. It just didn't seem like everybody was there besides Stuber. Bro, going home tomorrow or tonight, how do you go back? Do you do you go back happy with the season that Austin FC had, or do you are you going to let tonight ruin it, the whole season? No, it's a bittersweet, I would say, because, um, you know, I wanted to top off the season, you know, with – a championship with silverware um so I'm, I'm proud of the guys you know i'm proud of the the season definitely better than year one so you know we just it's a process we just got to trust it so i hope next year we come back stronger and hopefully get you know the mls cup talk to me about next year real quick what players do we need to reinforce austin fc with for next year to have a successful season like this one i want to say a center back and a striker Maybe uh, Chicho Arango? I don't know. Bro, Chicho Arango would be nice, but I don't want to hear that name for a good six months. Austin FC would definitely need a striker one shot on target tonight versus LAFC. Terrible performance, bro, like you said. Is there anything else you want to say, mate? No, just, I mean, you know, hats off to, you know, a good season, and let's try to run it back next season. Let's try to run it back. Shout out my G, Kevin Moreno, Los Verdes goalkeeper in Austin and in Venice Beach. Shout out, my G. We're Austin TV in L.A. You already know. Let's get it. What's up, y'all? We're Austin TV here in a brewery downtown L.A. Here with my G, Ray Ray. Unfortunate result today. 3-0 defeat. Got to go back home empty-handed, but what a great season for Austin FC. What can you tell me about this year, bro? It's been amazing. Like, what uh, supporters we've done for, for this whole year, the passion we put in, the TFOs we made, uh, all the volunteers that helped with everything. It's, it's been amazing. So the result sucks. But what we've done this year, it, it was amazing. Talk to me a little bit about the result, bro. 3-0 defeat. We thought that we were going to be more competitive with these guys. LAFC just seemed to run us over, man. What do you think went wrong, bro? A lot of things. Um, just players didn't do what they should have done. And, you know, it sucks. <laughs> it sucks going home with the loss, but it, we've won because we're a whole community. You can look everywhere. Everybody is just here just having fun just drinking with each other and, and sharing stories there's no piece, there's no reason to be mad it's just it's have fun what can you tell me about next year bro what can austin fc fans expect of next year at q2 stadium a couple new songs hey. we're working on Let's and go. new tifos we're working on ideas are being thrown around it's gonna be fun but, uh, what's up y'all we're austin tv here in a brewery downtown la aquí estoy con un compa 
3-0, Austin FC pierde la final de la Conferencia del Oeste. ¿Qué me dices de este juego, bro? Una lástima, pensé que iban a jugar mucho mejor, eh, pensé que iba a ser un partido más peleado, pero no, es, es difícil estar ahí y jugar al 100% todos los días, todos los partidos. No es fácil ser profesional, pero... Eh, LFC vino más pre mejor preparado, pienso yo. So, ¿Crees que fue mejor LFC y yo si nomás no vino uh, preparado? Pienso que LFC vino muy, muy preparado y era para meterle 4 o 5 goles en el primer tiempo. Y no sé, pienso que nos agarraron durmiendo un poco y cuando ya no metieron el primero, vino el segundo y el tercero y... Bro, ¿qué, ¿qué se le puede esperar a Austin FC el año que viene, el año 2023? Bueno, no sé, espero que traigan mucho... Bueno, tienen buen equipo ya, obviamente, pero pienso que si puede mejorar en la defensa, o agarrar buenos jugadores en la defensa, sería mucho mejor para el equipo. Y de ahí, no sé, pienso que es lo único que le falta. Shout out to my bro, we're out TV, downtown LA. You already know, let's get it. Hey, uh, one thing, just want to say thank you for an incredible season. We're out TV, wouldn't be anything without you guys. Make sure to subscribe to our channel, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, uh, YouTube here, follow our podcast, uh, Top Flight. Also, thank you to our sponsor, Guadalupe Cordova Realty. If you have any questions on real estate, make sure to hit her up. You can find her information down below. Thank you, everybody. Cheers to a great season. We'll see you soon. Thank you.